It was shot in December 1964 in the grounds of Britain's top secret chemical defence research establishment in Portendown, Wiltshire. These are members of the Elite 41 Royal Marine Commando taking part in a secret military exercise. It was codenamed Operation Moneybags, but the soldiers weren't told why. In fact, the name was a cruel pun. Unknown to them, they'd been fed LSD. At this time, one man is more severely affected than the others. Losing all contact with reality, dropping his rifle, and becoming unable to take any further part in the operation. In fact, he has to be withdrawn from the exercise a few minutes later. Horton had got word of the LSD experiments in psychiatric hospitals, and they wanted to try it out as a battlefield agent. Meanwhile, radio communication at the beaches has become difficult, if not impossible. Certainly not everyone found the experience unpleasant. Men with no specific task to perform have relapsed into laughter and inconsequential behavior, though they are still capable of sustained physical effort. This man nearly succeeded in felling this tree using only a spade. However, 70 minutes after the administration of the drug, with one man climbing a tree, the troop commander gives up, saying, I cannot do anything about this. I cannot control the men, and I can take no action myself. I am wiped out as an attacking force. In fact, the troop commander became seriously disturbed and nauseous. Two hours later, the effects of the drug are beginning to wear off. The troop commander, although feeling more capable of thinking and acting normally, is, in fact, still experiencing one of the characteristic effects of the drug. Everything he looks at appears to be patterned. While looking at the white ceiling, he describes geometrical patterns which are colored and three-dimensional. They appear to move in and out of each other.